Welcome back to Once Upon a Porn. Yeah, that's the name of this. Oh, it is nighttime. What is okay? I wonder what it's for. It lights up, but nothing else. I don't feel like it's working. It's I don't feel like it's in working order. I should ask Melly the next time I see her. Let's see if we can go see Melly. Nope, that leads to outside. Okay, where is Melly's? Because that used to also have the double option. Oh. Alright. Tano dress. Oh, so we need one more scrap. Okay. Now we can end the day. Alright, so let's try the oriental dress. How do we find her now? Hmm. Hmm. Because usually that's what we did in, in the first one. I'm coming, I'm coming! Oh, her wings didn't move, I don't think, in the first one. Hello, my dear employee! What can I do for you? Please ask. Okay, I don't think anything we need there. Hmm. Okay, so that just does that. Your Highness, Lyco. Anon, nice to see you again. I can't wait to get this soul problem solved. Has your research been successful? Yeah, I, I think I know why your soul is so cold. Tell me. Have you ever done anything kinky? Kinky? I am not sure about this. I once spent the entire day with my cloak on the wrong side. That was embarrassing. She is so pretty. I love the art. Wow, we've got work to do. Is that bad? I don't realize. Okay, let's get down to business. I agree. Let's not beat around the bush. Have you ever shown yourself naked to someone? Well, you saw me in my bath last time. I saw a back and arms. That's what I'm saying. I'm talking about real nudity, tits, ass, pussy. It is not possible to show this to a man. It's indecent. Not indecent, rather hot as a burning ember. So, this is really the only way I can get my kingdom back? Pervert my soul with obscene things? Yep. Well, I renounce. Great. Tinker, what do I do? No idea! Even the idea of taking back our kingdom is not enough. Try to start more slowly. More slowly, huh? Wait, I have an idea. Your Majesty, I have a suggestion. Why not try to take off your cloak? And expose my shoulders? Yes, expose your shoulders. I'll give it some thoughts. See you later, sir. You can leave. We can do it. Slow but steady wins the race. No, no, no. I gotta get used to the new setup. Where the fuck is Melly? Hola. 
Maybe later, sweetheart. Okay, where the fuck is Melly? I legitimately have no idea where she is now. Hmm. That used to be where we went and got her. So where did she get moved to? Nice. Always use credits. Nice. Droney being lucky today. I'll take it. Come on, Drono. Ooh. Okay. Again, I don't know where to find her now. No, that's it. That's just inventory. Yeah, I've got no idea what to do. Mm, we might want to go buy some more scrap. Look, game, I know what you're playing at. Hmm. Can we do any customization? Did anything from the first chapter? No. Okay, so nothing from the first chapter moved with us. Okay. Fair enough. There are technically two games. Hey, Tinker? Hi, what's going on? Where's my stuff? Your stuff? You got stuff? Oh! Oh! Yeah, my stuff. Plants, mugs, that kind of thing. Oh, I don't know. But if you want mugs, I got plenty to give you. Alright, I'll see where we put this year's stuff. I'll let you know as soon as I find it. Yeah, thanks, Tinker. In any case, feel free to take some mugs if you like. Do you have some kind of weird mug fetish? Mm, no, I've got a room full of them and I can't get rid of them. S anyway, see you later. And don't forget to find my things. Fuck off! Now we can make another set. Okay, so we need closed data. Okay. I don't think we can buy those yet. I've got to get new use of the new layout. It's going to drive me crazy at first. Hola, Anon. I have a gift for you. Ooh, so cool. Let me try it. Wow, I love the color. Oh, that is really pretty on her. I want to try this thing on the field so bad now. Nice slippers. They're very pointed. Do you have a problem with my shoes? Nah, they're fine. It's called a babouche. And if the, ama the, amana the Amandins design them well... Well, I like them a lot. I said nothing! When are you going out on a mission to try your outfit? Tinker wants to wait until you get rid of the Sultana. So hurry up and take care of her. So that I can take care of listing, listing the androids to corrupt. And by listing, I mean, yes, I know very well that you mean, Emmy. <laughs> Alright, let's see what he's selling. Do you have any of the furniture from my office? Why, did you lose your things? Tinker lost my stuff. Oh, well, yes, I picked up a lot of stuff. Honestly, it's mostly office furniture and that sort of thing. 
Oh, are you sure you don't have some leather sofas, silk curtains, and nude paintings of yourself? Of course, I store this in my ballroom. Right next to the my five and two bedroom. <laughs> yeah, I know, I really need a bigger ship. I'm still selling you the office stuff? Yep, that'd be nice. Hey, since you seem to have a passion for office stuff, I found something you might be interested in. A pencil cup in the shape of a naked tinker? Nah, an old PC. Uh, and it's usable? No idea. Frankly, this thing is a museum piece. This must be one of the oldest computers in the whole park. I think it must have belonged to the park's creator or something. Oh, interesting. I'll put it up for sale if you like. Maybe one day it'll come in handy. Yeah, fuck it. You only selling? Well, that went well. Where the fuck do I find Emmy? I'll figure it out. Greetings, Anna. How are you today, ma'am? Very well. Ready to take off your cloak? I have considered this proposal that you have made. And I think we can try. Wonderful. Under one condition? Of course there is a- of course there's a condition. You must not tell anyone about this. Not even Lyco? Like Chorus knows everything about me. I'm talking besides her and me. I don't want people to know that their sovereign is shameless. Of course nobody will know. Not a word. Oh, hi, Jin! Hi, Tinker. It's been a long time. Uh, are you still with me? Yo, yeah, uh, sorry, I, uh, I have voices in my head. Are you that confused that I can take off my cloak? Cute. Do you think it works? It's a good start. Do you find your soul warming up? I have no idea. But I feel naked without my cloak. Well, I think that's enough for today. Until tomorrow, sir. Alright, so. I still don't know how the fuck to get to her and it's driving me crazy. There's no other ways here. So, we might as well just go and use our bud. Uh, let's search the area. Yeah! Fuck! Fuck! You! Fucker! You bastard! I can't even afford it. Nice. Can't really do anything, can we? That should be good. These are all this, right? Okay, that's still the same. Oh, let's uh let's actually decorate, shall we? Oh, 
Oh, wow, that is a really old-looking computer, yes. Jesus, woman, how many mugs do you have? Okay, that looks good. Wow, where did you find this? I haven't seen this kind of PC in a hundred years- in hundreds of years! Emmy sold it to me. I really feel like I'm getting old seeing this. You know, I was created with this kind of machine. It's incredible when you think about it. So, what's your personal relationship with this thing? Do you consider it your brother, your father, your great-great-grandfather? Mm, have a little more respect for my ancestors, you young prick. See you later, Anon. <laughs> Can't turn it on or anything, no. Now, Lemmy's happy. Clothing creation. Okay, we just enough. Motherfucker, how do we find her now? I don't honestly know. Hola, why are you- No, 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 you change your clothes. There we go. Pretty. There we go, I like that outfit on you. That'll work. Yeah, there's nothing here. Well, let's go see. Hello? Anon! I'm so happy to see you again. Her Highness told me that you came back with the magic lamp. Indeed, and now we're trying to make her... make her grant a wish. Yeah, she told me. Do you have news of the Sultana? Did she notice that I had escaped? No, and no. The last time I heard her say that she left you to rot in her cage for your in your cage for eternity, but she hasn't been she hasn't been going out on the west side of the palace for a few days. That's good news. I really hope her highness will dethrone the sultana quickly. I can't wait to finally get out of this palace for a bit. Wouldn't you like to go back to your people? Ma, it's really far. I got used to the idea that I would be here for a while. We can visit the city together. It would be a great pleasure. I want to buy lots of new fabrics and create thousands of dresses. I know some people who would love you very much. You know where Sherazade is? In the gardens. She should be back in... Lycaris. Are you here? Well, that wasn't much of a wait. I will leave you with her. Good luck with the lamp with this lamp. I'm not glad to see you back. I really hope that we will be able to formulate this wish soon. What do you have planned for today? Is there anything new? You should take off another piece of clothing. Another piece? I don't really see what I can remove. Well, Well, there's no way she'll do the whole dress. You can raise up your dress. There's no- okay. Never. I don't have any other ideas, I must confess. Take your time to find out. Tinker, if you have another idea, I'm in. Hello, allow me to answer. I think I have an idea. Amandine? Oh, I know what voice I gave her. Wait, how many people look at me every time I go out? Find a way to get rid of the Sultana, and we'll, and we'll all have something else to do than watch you struggle with Shirazad. Yeah, so I was saying, I think I found a way. You should ask her to make this Lycris do stuff. If she makes her do some something perverse, it might corrupt her enough to move on. That's a good idea. You're welcome. Your Majesty, I have an idea. What is? What is it? How about undressing Lycaris for a bit? Hmm? If you want to see my maid naked, go and ask her yourself. No, the point is for you to ask her yourself. 
I see you're trying to warm the embers in me. I'll ask her. Lycoris, could you come here? I'm coming. What can I do for you? I would like you to help me with this lamp business. Sure, but by doing what? I would like you to undress. Ha- Hey, here? Now? Completely? Hmm. Do I have to do it right? Do I have a right to decline? Yes. Then I agree. Just give me some time to remove all of this. Do you think this will really help me in any way? It's worth a try. I do not know how Lycoris can show herself naked so easily. Maybe that's why your soul isn't as... Hot as burning ember, yes. You're probably right. I'm ready. You know what? No need for that, Lycoris. If I am to behave nobly, I don't have to ask someone else to do what needs to be done for me. I'll do it, sir. I'll... Excuse me? What did you say? I couldn't hear anything from there. So, what do I do? Should I take off my clothes or not? Go for it. No, you can put your clothes on like this. Too bad for you. <laughs> okay, so what happens if I say that? I changed my mind, Lycoris. As you wish, your highness. Perhaps another time, Anon? <laughs> Come back tomorrow, Anon. Alright, that's good. Let's see what we can do. Nice. I'll take that. We could definitely use money right now. And clothing data. Perfect. We won't be able to. Dang it. I'll get used to this at some point. Let's go to our quarters. Nothing we can really do from here. Arabian Night unlocked. Hey! Give me my dress! How do you know I have your dress? Don't you have anything else to do but watch me search for your dress? No, no. Let me try that. It is... it is... perfect! I look like a real princess from Arabian Nights! Except the breast size. But it's impossible to compete with Sherazad. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much! I'm finally in the mood for... Uh, in the mood of the moment. Alright, I think these... There are tons of things to do. We need to get the headquarters fully up and running again. This includes both employees and visitor sections. So the hotel, restaurants, the stores, and most of all, the interstellar teleporter. Because for the moment, we are a bit lost in the middle of nowhere. But first, we will focus on technical buildings. We need to be able to operate the planet properly before we have visitors. Gosh, will we be able to do all of this in my lifetime? Don't worry, with a few robot builders, it'll be over in no time. We need to hire more employees? Yes, tons of them. This planet needs hundreds of employees at the time of functioning properly. So yes, don't worry. You'll see new people very soon. And don't start fucking all the new girls, okay? I never said... Yeah, yeah, I know you. Hmm. Would it be something bad? As long as you don't slow down at the work and go have fun. 
I mean, if they want you. What kind of skills are we looking for? We need everything. Engineers, artists, managers. A planet-sized park with so many adventures, adventures to experience requires every possible skill to make it work. So, if you know reliable people, don't hesitate to tell me. I'll keep this in mind. Let's see. Well, she's happy. Okay, we have just enough. Wrong one. There we go. Greetings, Anon. Okay, that's the very same. Show me a boob. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Show me your boobs. You really have a way of presenting things. Alright, it's time then. Turn around. Really? What's the difference? I'm going to see them anyway. Do as I say. You see? I'm not that uptight. Oh yes, that's right. What? What's wrong? I was expecting less clothing. Hmm? And more breasts. Hmm. Did you really expect me to... To show my breasts? My bare breasts? Well, yeah, that's the idea. Hmm. I wasn't ready for that. Hmm. I'll have to think about it. Can you come back later? Of course. Have a good day, sir. I wonder in this version, can I see him twice in one day? Eh, I guess not. Time to go see Drony. Is, I don't, I, jeez, I just realized Petal isn't around. Nice. Oh, we're getting lucky with that. Nothing but credits today, boys. I'll take it. Always buy scraps before they go up in price. Emmy's Tano outfit unlocked. Hey, Emma, I was just looking for you. Oh, who the fuck are you? Glad to have you back with us. It is a real pleasure to see what you... to see that you are well. We were afraid that something had happened to you. Oh, well, thanks for that. I'm fine. Well, yes, I can see that. It's good to finally see you in real life. Oh, boy, I just figured it out. You're M.I., right? Well, Amelia, I mean. <laughs> yes, that's me. It feels good to finally be something other than a voice in a ship. Melisandre was kind enough to give me this body. So here I am. Anyway... Ms. Bell told me Miss Bell told me to come see you. She assigned me to recruit new employees. And since I'm new to uh well, in the real world, if you could help me, that would be really nice of you. I uh please say yes. And we could get to know each other. And it would be super fun. Please And I accidentally gave her the right voice. Patron heart Patreon heart indicates a Patreon exclusive option. They are only available for entering the newest Patreon code. We can do that. Uh, thank you to the patron of theirs that offered that to me. Wonderful. I'm so excited to work with you. You'll see I'm quick. I'm a quick learner. 
So people have asked why I do not give out the Patreon codes. I was, it's, supporters of these games give them to me when they give them the, me these games or they tell me about them. And I do want people to support the creators. So unless the creators specifically tell me it's okay, then I don't show them. As soon as you're available, come see me in my office. I can't wait to get started. First, let's go give the new outfit. I guess, uh, let's go outside. Oh, look. I have a new outfit for you. Ooh, let me see that. Now that's strange. I feel like I've seen this outfit somewhere. Oh, that is really pretty. Is it me or do I look like a bit like a knight? All I need is some kind of sword or a saber. You get the idea. Yeah, I don't know if you can convince Tinker to, to let you carry a sword in here. Let me break it down for you, Mark. Your mother and I have a relationship that is all about a master-slave dynamic. When I said she was more like a pet to me, I meant that in the most literal way possible. Remember that time you found a dog collar under the couch? And I told you, it was because we were getting you a dog. That was a lie, son. Truthfully, your mom likes it when I put her on a leash and walk her around the backyard. She's usually naked, of course. I can't explain why, but the whole thing is her idea. She'll piss on trees, sleep in dog cages, chew up furniture. She once took a full-sized adult woman shit in my dockers. Your mother is one fucked up slut, Mark, and I love her, but I'm not bringing that energy back to Viltrum with me. And frankly, she scares me sometimes. I don't know who molested her or how they did it, but there is some dark juju in that woman's head, and I just don't know if I'm strong enough to fuck it all away. Oh, we can still do it. We fucked Emmy. Well, that's a nice view. I hope this is the right office. Amelia, are you here? Hey, Anon. So happy to see you here. Welcome to my office. You'll excuse me, it's still a bit messy. I've seen worse. When I arrived, the place was filled with boxes and old things. Ms. Bell told me to put everything in your place thanks to- Thanks for taking care of it. Fuck. Oh, it was you. You could have thrown it away yourself. That's what I thought, but I didn't want to question Miss Bell's orders. So, she is so wise and smart. I'm sure she knows what she's doing. No, she's fucking with us. Mmm, what a stunning boss she is. Mmm, wow. Uh, yeah, sure. Anyway, did you want something? When do we start the job interviews? Uh, we'll start as soon as the first candidate is here. And when does that candidate do to arrive? She was supposed to be here yesterday. And we have to worry about that, or... I don't know. This planet is pretty hard to find. She may have got lost. I'll check with Tinker if she knows anything about it. Good idea. Miss Bell is surely aware of something. What is your job here? I am now officially Miss Bell's secretary. You mean Tinker? Yes. It's so nice to be so close to a woman like her. So talented, so charismatic. So char charismatic, I can read. So, hmm. Wow, you've got it bad. Amelia? Yes, yes, um, so I can take care of everything Madam wants. It can be administration things, fixing a teleporter, everything I can do. Yeah, I feel like you're the perfect person to follow all of her weird and irrational orders. Thank you, I think so too. Oh boy. Yep. Did Melisandre create this body for you? Well, yes. I mean, not really. In fact, she took as, she took as a model the former secretary that was on this planet back in the day. When Melisandre showed me her picture, I immediately saw myself. And then some of her stuff was still there, so... That's convenient. Apparently, she also left other belongings of hers in some outposts of the planet. If we find any, I'll have more 
than an, one outfit to wear. Yeah, if we do find some, we could try these together if you want. Oh, yes, it would be my pleasure. Apparently, she closed all these locks with the number 555. So, if you find the suitcases or a locker of hers, it'll probably be her opening code. Yeah, that can be useful. I'll write it down somewhere. Oh, wow, you actually, it does make a note. That's nice. What have you been... What have been... What have been your mission so far? What's been your mission so far? Many things, I must say. Miss Bell really makes me do everything imaginable. I repaired a teleporter, did cartography of the magic forest, did the budget for this year. Ah, uh, yes, indeed. It is diversified. And nothing sexual? Nothing at all. Yet, I have to admit, I'm looking forward to it. Would you like to bang Tinker? I, uh, I never said that. I wouldn't want to say I, uh, have you ever done it with Tinker? What, me? Get laid with Tinker? Nope. Never, not yet. And then, I don't know if it would fit, like, physically. It would be interesting to see if it could do it. So exciting. Horny. I think we're both going to be good buddies. So cool. So how does it feel to have a body? What a curious man you are. Okay, so we can't do anything in there yet. See you later. See you later, Anon. Cool, we got enough. We can't use Droney. So that will do it for this episode. So guys, thank you for joining me for another episode of Once Upon a Time. You guys are awesome. Don't forget to support the creator of the game, be it on Steam or on Patreon. The Steam version is different for very, very obvious reasons. But you can still play this version on Itch.io, which is what the versions I'm playing. Alright guys, keep being fantastic. Bye!